After years of waiting, fiber optic internet broke ground in Arizona today. The first ones to get access, a handful of residents in Mesa. Steve Nielsen is live on the fiber optic plan that's ahead for Google Fiber. Steve. Yeah, you know, we're still a few months away from anyone being able to have access to this, but these crews, they're working really fast. You can see they're filling in these trenches right now with concrete. This is called a micro trench. It's only about an inch, two inches thick, but it goes down about nine inches, and those are those fiber optic lines buried in the ground. Maya and her friends are cramming for their class, and internet connection is vital. That's why we stopped going to other places. This is a bad internet. They came to Nile Theater and Coffee Shop to work where they can count on the internet. Like we need it. We do online college, so it's important. The owner of the Nile says fast internet is of course crucial. And because we are using it for our POSs and then on the theater side, bands use it, iPhone users are using it. We any kind of faster, more steady Wi-Fi would be great for our location. That's what makes this exciting for many Mesa residents. Google Fiber has broken ground on fiber optic lines in some neighborhoods. The mayor says nearly every home will eventually have access. It's going to light your house up. You know, the down loading movies and your toaster talking to your cell phone, all of that stuff, the Internet of Things, you know, that we all aspire to. That's what this is going to facilitate. Limiting the construction headache, crews are digging micro trenches an inch wide to lay lines. This will be the first city in Arizona to have fiber optic internet after Google backed out of Tempe, Scottsdale, and Phoenix in 2015 after some litigation. A lot has changed within our, our company and what we are asked and how we deploy this infrastructure. And so it's a kind of a new new day and new opportunity. And uh, we're excited to get out here and, and get going. And the speed here is pretty impressive. We witnessed them cut this trench uh, about two, three hours ago, and already they got the lines in, and now they're pouring the concrete on top of it here. And they need to move fast because they want to get all of Mesa covered in the next four years. The people in these neighborhoods here, they can start signing up for it in the spring, and eventually they do want to start moving to the other cities in the valley. Reporting live in Mesa, Steve Nielsen, Fox 10 News.